departments across the region are rushing. They are rushing to finish projects before they have to turn their attention to plowing snow. And in Burlington, work this week unearthed an interesting piece of history. WPTV's Jack Thurston tells us all about it. Digging through layers of city life. On busy Main Street in Burlington, Vermont, where the Public Works Department is updating its sewer system. In the process, discovering this week part of a network of old water pipes underground. And get this, they're made of wood. They've long been inactive and abandoned. We immediately knew it was history. Rob Green's with DPW. We've all heard of wooden water mains, but this crew's never ran into one. He bets the wooden water line dates to about 1870, to when downtown Burlington didn't look much like a city at all. To Green, the piping is a reminder of all the progress that's been made in public infrastructure since then. Also, of what still needs to be done. We're in better shape than most cities. He's been handling a flurry of projects in recent weeks new sidewalks, waterfront and bike path improvements, and more. Is there enough money to do everything at once? Never. But we do, we do so much per year. And on the federal level, Vermont's junior U.S. Senator hopes infrastructure repairs will be a big focus of the new Senate starting next year. In my view, what we have got to do as a major, major priority is create millions of decent paying jobs in this country. And I think the best way to do that is rebuilding our crumbling infrastructure. As for Burlington's nearly forgotten wooden water line, the Public Works Department has learned of some Vermont communities that still use ones like this. Here, though, the plan is to save a piece of the system and display it. In Burlington, Jack Thurston, WPTZ News Channel 5.